Kev, thanks for joining us. First off, congratulations. How important to sign off with a win and performance like that? Yeah, I think, um, I mean, our last, we've won the last two games now. The gaffer said to us, it's important to go into the playoffs with a good rain of form. And we kept a clean sheet last week. And me, I'm just about conceded today, but I thought defensively we were, we were really good today and they, they gave us a platform to play off. But uh, as you say, it's good to, to get two wins before the playoffs, but it means nothing when, <laughs> once you get there. You mentioned team momentum, but nice to have a bit of personal momentum as well. Two goals for you in the first half. Yeah, well, the only reason it's good to be scoring is because I think it will win us games. Uh, and I think it, it's good for the team when your striker is scoring in and it, it gives the defence a bit of um, a bit of confidence as well. So, yeah, it's good for the team, but as you say, it's, it's a new league we're going into now. Club record broken today, 12 away wins. How important has the away form been this year? Yeah, it's been massive. I don't think you can you can look to get promoted or, or do well in this league unless you've got a good away performance, I think. We've got a great back four and they give us a, a platform to work off. And a good number of travelling fans, they've played their part all year. Yeah, they, they were unbelievable today. I've um, never seen them like that. Um, and I hope um, when we play our, our first game next week that they're exactly like that because without them, um, as a team, we, we wouldn't do well. And I'd say they drove us on today, I thought. Third place secured in the league. How keen were you to do that? Um, I, I think it was more important to, to get a win today and it was more important to, to play well. and. Um, everyone go into the playoffs confident because, as you say, um, when we're confident, we feel like we're a good team, um, and I think that was the most important thing. Not where we finished in the league. Did you have your eye on anyone in the playoffs at all? No, no, absolutely no chance. Um, probably a lot of teams would like to play us, but um, I think we're, we're a good side and, and I think we're confident now. But as, as in, would we like to play anyone particular? No, no chance. We know the opponent's going to be Peter Brunel. Played twice, they've won one, we've won one. What, what sort of test do you expect? I think they were a better team than when we played them at their place. I think they've got a, a good form now, they've got good results. I'm not sure how they play today, but I think the last few games, the last few weeks and months, I think they've been really good. They've won the cup. Um, so they're, they're an organised side, they've got a good manager and he knows what he's doing. So I think it'll be a very tough game. 46 games now completed of the regular season, and you've played a lot of games yourself. How pleased you to sort of rack up, get into the 40s this year with appearances? Yeah, I think last season I picked up a few injuries at major times, and I was out for a long while. So I mean, the physio and the fitness men have been working hard with me um, on and off the field to make sure I'm, I'm on the field when, the, when game time comes. And I think we've paid off for it as a team. Are you looking forward to it now, the player? Yeah, yeah. I can't wait. I wish we could play tomorrow. Um, but yeah, yeah, it'll be a good experience. We've got a few young boys in our team and we're just going in there and hopefully we enjoy ourselves and see what happens. The gaffer mentioned he wants not much to change, he wants continuity. <laughs> Is that going to be important this week, keeping people's feet on the ground and everything? Yeah, definitely. I don't think you're going to have to. I think we're going to go in there, the underdogs. So we know each and every game we're going to have to work 100% to, to get any sort of results because they're big clubs in the in, in the playoffs and they've spent big money and we haven't. So um, we're going to, we know every single game, I say it before the games, we can't slack off because we're not good enough. And just lastly, that takes your tally to 17 as your highest return. I thought it was 18. 18. Oh, 18, sorry. <laughs> sorry <yeah. laughs> okay, no takes your tally to 18, but that's your, your highest return for yeah. the O's. You must be pleased with that. Yeah, it's massive. I mean, as I say, as long as I'm scoring and we're winning, it's massive. Um, I'd like to hit the 20s as well because I felt like I should have this season and, and I went on a bit of a, a bad run, but um, hopefully I'm coming to form. Me and Moons and Coxie and Mo. Um, as a front four are coming into form just at the right time.